What's going on guys? Today I'm going to do a quick review of the Oral-B IO Series 9 electric toothbrush. In this video I'm going to tell you everything you need to know about this toothbrush, including one thing you should know before buying. So guys, as of late, uh, my wife and I have been testing out different toothbrushes, and this is, at the moment, one of the better ones that Oral-B actually offers. Uh, and it is really, really good. I like a lot of things about it. Um, but before I get into the toothbrush itself, let's talk about what it comes with, right? So it comes with uh, a charger that, this is the charger that you put onto here, and obviously it'll charge when it's, uh, when it's going. I like the fact that this right here um, doesn't really stick out much. Uh, it makes it really easy to clean. That's why I like that. Uh, Cause some of them, you know, you have to really stick it on something and it just doesn't clean easy. So this one obviously is easy to clean. So that is, you know, your everyday charger. This here is the uh, travel case. And this is actually to charge the travel case. So if you travel often and you wanna bring your toothbrush with you, Yes, this one does um, actually charge with the travel case. Uh, and it comes with, I don't have them on camera now, but it comes with four total brush heads. So this is one of them, comes with four total when you purchase it. And it was hard to get inside with one hand, but this is the, um, you know, the carrier when you actually, uh, you know, if you're traveling. So you just put the bottom of the toothbrush here, top here, and then this is where you can put a brush as well. So nice little carrying case. Uh, and like I said, charging port there. So the toothbrush itself is good and there's a whole app to this, right? So I'm gonna show you the app in a second here. Um, but basically there's a number of different things uh, to note. So first off, the, um, you know, the actual bristles on the toothbrush try to focus in there. The actual bristles on the toothbrush are pretty long compared to some of the others. They go with the circular as well. Um, and using it, it is very soft, but also firm, if that makes sense. That's kind of a weird thing to say, but it is soft and firm. It does a really good job of cleaning your teeth and also massaging your gums. Now the battery life on this. So charging it, I actually don't know how long it takes to charge this all the, um, you know, from, from start to finish. Uh, I'd say probably like a couple hours, two to three hours. Uh, but frankly, you know, oftentimes, which many people do, I'll just set this on there at night, right? So it's hard for me to say exactly how long uh, it does to charge. But what I will say is, is it holds a charge, uh, you know, with regular use twice a day, brushing for two, three minutes, holds a charge for about 30 days, roughly. I actually had to look that one up. Um, I haven't really had any issues at all with that, but just want to let you know, it does hold a charge for a very long time. So you don't have to kind constantly, you know, be charging it like I think most of us probably would do anyways, put it there. Uh, but you don't have to do that. It will last quite some time. So if you're traveling or something like that, you know, a week or two, don't even worry about this, should be just fine. Now, in terms of the cleaning modes and everything like that, right? So um, this actually has a lot of different cleaning modes. So I'm going to turn it on real quick. Okay. And we have daily clean. Well, we have sensitive, which I usually use uh, sensitive on my teeth. I have sensitive teeth. So sensitive, whiten, Gum care, so this is specifically to massage your gums. Uh, intense, that's a really, you can probably hear it even, that's a much stronger version, I don't use that. Super sensitive, I think, you know, my teeth are sensitive, not super sensitive, so I'm good there. And then tongue clean. Uh, so those are the different modes that you can use. And then another cool functionality about this, so you notice how this is like a whitish blue right now, right? So when you press down on it, oh, let's assume that you're actually brushing, Green's good, that basically means, yeah, that's the right amount of pressure, you're doing well. If you press too hard, so I'm pressing a little harder, pressing a little harder now, it turns red. So this is actually kind of a big deal. It lets you know if you are pressing too hard while you're brushing. And you may think, ah, oh, no, I don't do that. You know, I'm not one of those people. I didn't think I was either. Um, and it, But it does point it out, which is kind of a cool thing. So yeah, guys, overall, very good brush just in and of itself, a lot of good functionality. But the app is frankly a lot cooler than just the brush, right? And you may be thinking, and I was thinking this, an app for brushing really, that's kind of too much. It's not, uh, this teaches you proper brushing technique. And you may think, I don't need that. I've been doing it right my whole life. You haven't, uh, most likely. I could tell you from personal experience. So I actually uh, had tested this a lot uh, with Tuesday and then um, a little bit today. But basically uh, this particular score kind of tells you how you're brushing each day. It kind of uh, logs your traits, if you will, right? So when we go into here, you can see, well, what's your coverage on any given day, right? You can see your coverage 
for your actual brushing. And it really helps to understand your, your, you know, what you're doing, what you're not doing. This tells you right here, hey, you're putting too much pressure, right, on just out here. And this is for the whole week, right? This isn't for today, but you're putting too much pressure here and you were doing fine all around here, right? Um, and then they have, I mean, I won't go through all these, but brush time, gum guard, and additional routines. You can see some of the brushing. I think this was... This was when I was setting it up. Um, I probably need to sync this app, to be honest with you. But uh, that's basically what it will do. So it's pretty cool because when you're actually brushing, so right now, it syncs in real time. So let's go ahead and turn it on. Okay, it knows, hey, you're brushing. So let's pretend like we're brushing. No, oh, putting too much pressure. See? So now we're doing this. And it's gonna have a hard time because of the way that the brush is. It's not actually in the mouth. It's gonna have a hard time recognizing what teeth but right here, if I was doing it properly, it would be thinking, oh, you're brushing the lowers, right? That's what you're brushing right now. And as you can see, it's kind of changing colors. That's why it does that, is because it's sensing. Now, if it's in my mouth, right? Here, we're gonna move it over to here and see if we can get a different thing. Yeah, see, if it was in my mouth, it would actually recognize the right teeth. So you're like, well, right now you're just doing it on a table and it's doing that. Well, yeah, it's doing that because it thinks that I'm in my mouth right now. But when you hold it properly, in your mouth and you're doing this, it will recognize that you are brushing uh, whatever set of teeth, you know, what area of teeth that you need to in your mouth, right? So that's how it actually works. Um, I don't know if I can even get the up, the upper part, I can't. But that's basically what it does, right? It will actually look at the areas that you're brushing and it will sink. And then when you're done, right, and you want to go the full time, when you're done, it says, hey, this is how you did. This, this was your overall score, your brush time, your coverage, where you were over pressure, you know, inside, outside chewing. Did you clean your tongue, floss? Did you rinse? You say yes or no to these, and then you save. So it keeps all this stuff uh, logged. And you can see your trends over time and see how you've been brushing. So it's actually really cool functionality. Now, my, my favorite thing about this that I think is really cool, um, and I had an Oral-B IO that wasn't on this app before, but one of the things that I like about it a lot is that you can basically kind of gamify everything. So if you're th saying, you know, I really want to fight my bad breath, it will give you kind of a routine, uh, like a goal to say, hey, this is, okay, we're going to do normal brushing, but this is the routine that will help you freshen your breath or white your teeth or fight plaque or gum health, et cetera, right? And then your devices, if you want to add them, you know, into the app, super easy to do. Basically, you just press a button to add them, you turn on the brush, it auto detects it with the Bluetooth. So if you're worried about setup, super easy, guys. All you do is download the app, basically turn it on and it'll sync up. It's pretty much flawless. Uh, and then more, which are other settings that you can use as well. So yeah, guys, if you are looking for a really high quality electric toothbrush, um, I, I can't recommend this thing enough. Um, I think that they are very, very good at what they do. I think this app is underrated. I think that a lot of people, if they had this, would realize um, they're probably not brushing right. I mean, me, I always was putting too much pressure and moving my arm too much and doing things I shouldn't have been doing. This app uh, has really helped me get better at that. Uh, and it's something that I definitely recommend to everybody because if you brush too hard, it actually can harm your teeth. So overall, great product, great toothbrush. And like I said, if you're considering it, you're not going to regret it, guys. Um, you know, it's, it's definitely not a budget toothbrush, but it's a very, very good one. So hopefully that helps.